voice we heard. It was Zivu Arath. I had only heard her voice in audio logs from the fall of the Cabal homeworld. There's no mistaking her. She must be near. We need to be careful. Her influence has never been this strong. We need to find Sloan and get her out of here now. You're almost at the Array Guardian. Get moving. Go! Councils here at Siren's Watch say the array is unpowered. Guardian, you need to find a way to reroute power, then properly align the array's receivers. Sloan's position is one kilometer down. She is in the ocean. It is a sea of crushing methane. Nothing can survive there. I wouldn't be so sure of that. Guardian, rig schematics show a ballast maintenance shaft near your position. Follow the signal down and find the deputy commander. I'll join up with you shortly. Arrived at the diving point. I'm coming down to you. That ain't gonna happen, boss. Do you know how much pressure they're taking? They gotta get out of there. I am not leaving anyone behind again. And I ain't saying we do. All right, that's enough. I'm pulling you up before you and your ghosts get flat. Welcome to the derelict. I'm down in engineering, making sure we don't blow up. Zavala's got his heart in the right place, but old Blue's about as stubborn as they come. You can't brute force this moon. The collapse messed the whole place up good. Gravity's weird down in the deep. There's pockets of air. Some places you can move safely. Others that'll crush you into a little speck. But I think I got something in my gets that'll help us out. Titan ain't my first aquatic rodeo. Go ahead and try out that prototype. Should protect you from the pressure. Well, some of it, at least. Now get on out of here. I'll fill the boss man in for you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Guardian. You're almost at the source of the distress signal. I've acquired one of Drifter's devices. I'll be joining you momentarily. Sloan? Here, Commander. You're alive. Staying alive was the mission. And I always complete the mission. No wonder you called us, sister. Let's get you back home. You don't understand. That distress call wasn't for me. It was for her. <laughs> 